Price here, um, coming to you from the desk. It's been a while since I've done a From the Desk episode, and um, so here we go. Uh, today is Friday, April 1st, and it is my birthday. So anyway, I want to start off by thanking all of you wonderful, wonderful friends and family of mine who have uh, taken the time out of your day to wish me a happy birthday. Uh, my Facebook wall has just blown up. And um, anyway, I, it's impossible for me to respond to each of you um, individually. So uh, take this as a thank you. Thank you. Uh, this morning, I had the pleasure of speaking to the Women's Council of Realtors, uh, Tex Texas District C. Uh, try to say that like four times really fast. Uh, anyway, that encompasses the Houston area and uh, Texas Bay area as well. So had the opportunity to um, share a little bit about creating an online um, strategy for social media and uh, otherwise and very receptive audience I appreciate all 85 to 90 of you that were there uh, it was a great honor to uh, bring some of my knowledge and uh, share some of that and uh, engage in conversation about it as well so thank you for having me it was a great honor and I love my WCR family so anyway this morning while I was there um, I shared a little bit about the um, ruling that came from the appellate court last night, late last night, about 1130 uh, here in, in Texas, that the Fed uh, Regulation Z, the Fed rule that um, was supposed to be implemented first thing this morning, April 1st, uh, actually was put on hold by the appellate courts in Washington, D.C. They overruled a judge, a federal district judge, that um, had actually ruled that it was good to go and continue forward. Uh, NAMB, which is the National Association of Mortgage Brokers, and NH, NAIHP, uh, National Association of Independent Housing Professionals, uh, or Housing Independent, whatever, anyway, um, filed a lawsuit against the feds, uh, basically claiming that irreparable harm will be done because of this rule, and um, that it actually may be unconstitutional because the government um, has basically put out terms of compensation uh, for loan officers. So I don't want to get into a whole bunch of the details because I think that uh, there's plenty of information out there. You can check my blog um, to find out some more information about it. That's all we know uh, until Tuesday or Wednesday of next week. There won't be any further ruling. There won't be any further information coming out. Uh, the feds have to present their case to the appellate court and then uh, the two organizations that filed the lawsuit will get the chance to um, to counter that information that the Fed provides. So we'll see what happens next week. I will be bringing more information to you about that uh, as more uh, news and information about it come out. So um, anyway, just wanted to share that. Some people had no idea what it was about whenever I spoke um, on it this morning and shared that. But uh, basically, the Fed has decided to tell um, the mortgage industry how they could pay loan officers. And because of that, there will be um, unforeseeable consequences. Uh, consumers will end up paying more money for loans. Uh, consumers will actually have a harder time attaining mortgages because of the rule. And uh, again, further down the road, who knows really what consequences could come out of this. So in the name of consumer protection, the Fed decided to create this rule. And now because of the rule, because of the intricacies and details within the rule that we're seeing coming out, uh, we are actually seeing that it is, it's not a good thing. So these two organizations have decided to stand up and fight uh, on behalf of consumers and on behalf of those of us in the mortgage industry. So I appreciate uh, the work that these two organizations are putting out there and um, you should look into it. Again, you can find more information on my blog or just Google it because uh, there's a lot of information out there as to what this Fed rule does uh, or is intended to do and what its unintended consequences may actually be. So I wanted to put that out there and give that information to you guys. Uh, I'm gonna get out of here, uh, try to make this a quick video because I'm going to uh, start my birthday party and my birthday celebration as soon as the rest of my family gets home. And I hope you guys have a wonderful Friday and a wonderful weekend as well. And um, that's, that's it. That's really it for this episode of From the Desk. God bless and we will talk to you soon. Bye. Thank you.